So the plates and cutlery are all ready and the big dining room of the Bharat Mandapam which is going to serve food to over 3,000 journalists both domestic and foreign is all set to host dinner. Now a unique aspect of India's G20 presidency is the way it has used food to reflect its ethos, uh, its diversity. Now look here, uh, this is now all of this is vegetarian so you have uh, uh, food from different parts of the country. India on plate is how officials are descri describing this menu but apart from that this food is also sort of like you know has been curated made uh, to suit international taste buds you have uh, Kapula, which is something that all of us love then a unique aspect is also uh, you know dishes made of super grains like jowar and millets then you also have makhana something that is uh, very famously grown in India something that India has been very proud of of course some of those pani lababda dishes which um, you know, it is sort of like really famous uh, throughout and you have this, uh, this is the Kaju Matar Makhana. It's very hot and uh, the food is going to be, uh, uh, the dining area is going to be open to people now. Uh, this is some international uh, continental stuff. Um, so it has equal numbers of uh, dishes made for Indians and of course some uh, uh, for the foreign journalists. Remember there are around 2,000 to 3,000 domestic and foreign journalists who have come here and uh, there are about 48 hours to go before uh, the leaders actually uh, you know, uh, declared the resolution. Uh, there is a lot of wait for that. Of course there is also a lot of contention as to if uh, you know, a leader's declaration will actually come out or not. So food is going to be reassuring, uh, the reassuring aspect of it. This is is where this is the soup center the branding of it is also quite unique and everywhere you see visuals and uh, pictures that reflect Indian uh, life you know mostly rural life and of course there is uh, there are these big holdings of desert and soups and another interesting part is of course no uh, meal is complete without uh, desert and uh, this is of course the soup counter and then this is the desert counter and what we are told is there are deserts from different states of uh, the country remember that g20 also was not limited to delhi and it was held in 60 uh, different cities and 230 events held in different cities that was the prime minister's promise to make g20 a democratic exercise and activity so that is sort of uh, reflected here you have the kutu mal pua which is which is of course buckwheat is also a superfood and it's also super grain this is something that uh, you know we, we uh, see people uh, you know eating during navratri so that that is going to be so all of that is reflected reflected here. Uh, so this uh, dining area is going to be open uh, to the foreign guests soon. This is the first meal that Bharat Mandapam will be serving to international, international journalists and also to domestic journalists. Uh, with camera person Rahul, this is Vasudha Venugopal for NDTV.